Let's take a look at this math problem, which at first glance seems very simple. Just a few operations, without powers or fractions, but in reality, it often confuses many people. The question is this. What is the value of 9 plus 10 times 11 times 2 minus 8? Very often, people solve it like this. First they add 9 plus 10 and get 19. Then they multiply 19 by 11 and get 209. Next they multiply 209 by 2, which gives 418. Finally, they subtract 8 from 418 and get 410. It sounds logical, but this is actually incorrect because that method breaks the rule of the order of operations. So how do we solve it correctly? Let's go step by step and apply the order of operations. First, we solve what's inside the parentheses. 11 times 2, that equals 22. So now the expression becomes 9 plus 10 times 22 minus 8. Now the parentheses are gone, but notice that 10 is written right next to 22. In math, that means multiplication. So we do 10 times 22, that equals 220. Now our expression looks like this. 9 plus 220 minus 8. Now we are left with only addition and subtraction. They have the same priority, so we go from left to right. First, 9 plus 220 equals 229. Then, 229 minus 8 equals 221. So the correct final answer is 221. To solve problems like this correctly and avoid mistakes, we must always follow the order of operations. This rule helps us solve even complex equations step by step, simplify problems, and prevent errors. Now it's your turn. Write in the comments, what is the value of 7 plus 5 times 6 times 3 minus 4? Don't rush. Apply the rule we just discussed and see what you get. I'll be waiting for your answers in the comments. And if you enjoyed this breakdown, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel.